In this video, uh, I'll show you how to uh, use the STM32 Blue Pill as a voltmeter. So I'm using, uh, I'll be using an FTTI adapter. You could also use the official STM32 connector or dongle. And uh, make sure to put the jumper at 3.3 volts. Uh, this is because the STM32 Blue Pill works at 3.3 volts. Then hook up everything in the breadboard. Then the VCC, connect the VCC of the FTD adapter to the 3.3 of the STM32 Blue Pill. And ground to ground. Now uh, you will be using the A19 to the uh, to connect to the receive pin of the FTDI adapter and the transmit pin of the FTDI adapter to the A10 of the uh, STM32 blue pill. And I'll be using the A0 as our uh, analog input. Then I'll be using a 10K uh, potentiometer along with the 100K resistor. So we'll be building a voltage divider where in uh, the uh, the V out will be connected to the A0. Uh, before anything else, hook uh, put the jumper to program mode like shown here, so that you can program using the uh, um, UART or FTD adapter. Now make sure to click reset. For anything else then I have my power supply here let's test our uh, circuit to 5 volts first let's see if it's the voltage reading of our STM32 blue pill will coincide with the power supply And the use of the potentiometer is really to calibrate our readings. If you have a known voltage, uh, make sure to calibrate it using the serial monitor. And and that's it. That's quite accurate compared to our power supply voltage reading. Now, uh, let's try to crank up a bit to 12 volts. Let's see. Uh, the reading is still uh, coincide. And as you can see, uh, it's quite uh, relative to the uh, power supply's output. So that's how you make uh, STM32 